Afrobeach news. So guys, share let's talk about this one. So there's been rumors and reports going about that Bonaboy allegedly, right, have sold his soul to this whole LGBTQ movement, right? And this is because Bonaboy of recent in some of his mega shows, like his own mega shows where he's been putting on like dresses, right? Church gowns and all the rest. Bonaboy, no cap, having wearing dresses. And fans are beginning to feel like Bonaboy, you know, allegedly have sold his soul and he's just trying to play into this liberal uh, pro lgbtq movement and probably could sign that kind of lifestyle putting on dress and all of that stuff and all of these have actually come to a point where um anything that bonaboy does pretty much is viewed from that lens and especially when he linked up with leona's ex so bonaboy linking up with leona's ex made some fans feel like bonaboy indeed is co-signing that lifestyle and uh going in that direction and he's he sold his soul pretty much now luckily one of the guys that recently came out to defend bonaboy in the u.s is none other than dj academics so dj academics recently spoke about bonaboy linking up with leona's ex explaining that it's nothing more than just a strategic um uh, business move and uh, strategic move musically to take to dominate more in the u.s so guys here i'm going to show you guys a clip but before i'm going to show you guys a clip don't forget guys to like and subscribe turn on post notification and stay tuned for more afro beach related entertainment and just here's a clip roll it hey, what's your thoughts on burner boy and little Nas x linking up i've seen everybody saying that burner boy linking up a little Nas x means it's like some betrayal of the african community and we lost burner that's not true burner boy i think is a phenomenal talent he's coming to city field to perform this month i'm gonna go see it he is showing that by the way him and davido has something like going back and forth right now burner boy is almost like americanized globalized the the um Afro, Afro beats music. The Afro, well, 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 obviously people did it before him, but he doesn't come now, across I, I like. A, I agree with you saying. He doesn't I had that come across that. as an international artist. He comes across as a artist from America, and no, I, I, agree. Yeah. I, I think he's done that very well by tapping in with the culture. Um, shit, when you go, I saw that nigga in Miami. He running around with Miami niggas like yo he he tap in with like people of this culture you know um he did a song with 21 savage you see him doing music with other people i i, I feel like he does a really good job him and doing songs with Lil Nas X you probably thought it was a cool global thing he could do i don't think he is co-signing his lifestyle nothing like that i just think it's something cool he could do uh, so guys here tell me what do you think about this particular clip do you think that Bonner boy finally have sold his soul and uh probably he's going in this direction that most people don't want to you know see him go into or do you think that like dj academic said this is just a strategic uh move by Bonner boy and it seem to dominate even more in the states and guys in the middle, don't forget to like and uh subscribe and uh, stay tuned for more Afrobeach related entertainment and gist content. I'm for now. Peace.